Hello viewers, John Serino with CH Insurance Brokerage. We're here for our weekly insurance chat. Today we have Michelle Porto, who's our Vice President of Marketing. And I'm gonna ask Michelle a very general question that I get um, often. Michelle, I'm starting a new business. Mm -hmm. What are the types of coverages that I need? Okay, sure. Things that your agent will probably end up asking you are about your property. Property is building coverage. If you own the building, right, you need to have insurance on that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, personal property coverage. Anything inside the building that you own of yours. Desks, chairs, computers, equipment, that type of stuff. Okay. You'll also be asked with the property, is your building sprinklered? Because is you there, credits have, for there are credits for that. Sure. Absolutely. Um, that makes a big difference. Do you have a burglar alarm, a fire alarm, anything used to protect the building? Right. You're going to be asked what deductible you want. Okay, two fifty, five hundred, a thousand. So I have options. Oh, you sure do. Beautiful. Yes, yes. You're going to be asked about general liability insurance. Okay, bodily injury, property damage, third party coverage. Okay, that's going to be rated based on either sales or payroll. Typically, if you're a manufacturer, it's based on sales. If you're a contractor, your general li liability is rated based on payroll. Okay. What if I don't have, what if I don't have an automobile? Mm-hmm. Can I still get some kind of auto coverage? Sure. You can get hired and non-owned liability coverage, which we would recommend you get every time. Okay. Okay, for every policy. That's going to cover you in the event that you are using a personal vehicle on company business. Right. Okay, driving to the bank, driving to a job site anything like that, you need that liability coverage, which will be typically access over your personal auto policy. Okay, great. Okay. And then of course, we all know workers' compensation. Right, right. In New York State, that is required. Workers' compensation and New York State disability. You're gonna be asked, what do your employees do? Mm -hmm. Are they sitting at a desk all day doing clerical work? Are they out in the field? Are they using a shovel? Are they using equipment? Right. You know, that type of thing. And that, that is going to be rated based on payroll for the employee. And a premium will be calculated based on that information. Great. Is there anything else that you think I would probably need to, to get going? Well, no. I mean, you know, we're going to ask about your federal employer ID number. Sure. Okay. You know, but no, I, th I think that would get a good start. And then there's always other coverages available. Cyber liability, employment practices liability. And your agent you know, will talk to you about that. Absolutely. Be mm -hmm. Beautiful. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. Thank you, viewers. As always, CH is in your corner.